Hey there YouTube, Bow Tie Madness here, and I uh, had a couple requests uh, about the racing mower. Well, you ain't much going to believe this when I show you it, because it doesn't look the same right now, but there it is. That's the one my buddy Nick was running. Uh, what I done was I switched the spindles. I took the spindles and put on that racing mower over there. Now I'm going to put them back on this because that thing ain't going to get done for a long time. It looks things the way I work here it ain't going to. But uh, then uh, of course my hood got busted uh, when we first took this off road. And so now I got this hood I uh, got off a of body. It bolted on. It doesn't fit right but <coughs> having a heck of a time finding a, a hood that does fit this. Uh, my brother he's trying to build a racer he can't find a hood either. But there's the motor. Got the couple in there to pull start because battery's all the time dead. There's the air filter. You can see the dog got it. It's been sitting there parked. The dog's been chewing at it. And that's the homemade apparatus I made a couple years back for it. There's the carburetor. You can't really tell, but it was all rebuilt and uh, the main jet was drilled out on it. I ported the intake. Ported the intake side of the block. The exhaust was ported. And uh, I might have an E3 plug in it, I'm not sure. Well, there's the return spring. And uh, my buddy, he uh, made the throttle cable for it. It was on there when I got it. So I got it off him. They had a different motor. And uh, I just, from where the cable goes through, it's just a little cut right there. I just snipped it with my uh, side cuts. And then put the cable through and squeezed it back shut. But uh, so that's that's pretty much it. It's got the still starter gear, and uh, it had had a gas tank on the side of it one time too. See the bracket. But uh, we didn't need that with this. It actually uh, had two tanks on it at one time on another mower, not this mower. There's a little gas in there. But uh, yeah, so. Next question was the pulleys. So just bear with me here. Uh, better latch the hood. Hood pin don't fit now. Holy crap, the tires are flat. Circles are down. Circles are down. Uh, let me switch hands here, tubers. There's the engine pulley. It's, uh, I got lucky once along the line. That was actually a mower deck pulley. It was keyed the whole way through and I just cut it in half. You can tell. And uh, then I had to make a new bolt. The bolt was real long. So I cut it, took a nut that was bigger and put it on it. And uh, I think I have a bigger one I can put on it too, but that one works pretty good. There's the, the tensioner and the clutch and then back there, I can get a good view, there's, there's the, the back pulley, and there it is, again, it's really little, but uh, the brakes are hooked up, there's the exhaust, so, I'm steering, but it's actually going to get back into the, we're going to bring it back in here in the next couple days, and uh, I'm, like I said, I'm going to put them other spindles on it. And I want to try to find it. I, mean, I might just put the hood off that race motor on it. It might fit it a little better. There's the rope. But yeah. We're, uh, we're going to get it off. Oh, there's the throttle. We'll show you the throttle. See? It was actually the deck engagement. He didn't have that. I welded that washer on there. And then uh, you, know, you got the big spring. So This is what I did the jump with. And then of course I put bigger tires in the front. I think it's probably still put them big tires on the front with the other spindles to take it off road. And, but then I can switch to smaller tires when uh, when I want to rip. You know, if I want to tear the grass up, go fast, I can just jump on it, switch tires, go play. But yeah, so uh, that's it. And I'll show you the spindles here quick. We'll walk up here to the racer. There it is. I might be able to make that hood fit it. 
with the decals and stuff all in it. There's a there's the spindles right there. Made them. They were made minus that. The spindles were made to uh, to fit right on that racing mower. And uh, with the stock front end, the stock the axles as well it's solid. They don't pivot, but they fit right on there. And the stock steering linkage bolt you know, sits right down in there. And uh, you know, your stock drag link from the steering steering arm back, everything fits. So that, like maybe if I wreck that, I could go out and find another craftsman like it, put them spindles right on it. Now that's my goal was to make them interchangeable like that and I did it so but uh yeah that's it for now so till tomorrow tell your buddies tell all your buddies I want to see my subscriber count go up because if I get uh I got 26 subscribers right now if I can make it to like 40 50 subscribers I'm gonna do a contest and uh my buddy Bill's Team Max, you can check out his channel, Bill's Team Max, and uh, he makes decals. He makes awesome videos too, awesome videos. But I'll get him to cut some decals and uh, maybe we'll give out some decals. But, uh, you know, gotta get subscribers. Can't play, can't play the contest unless we got enough subscribers. Make it fun. So, till tomorrow.